X spoiled kids, what was your reality checks? Joining the workforce. Very first day of my first job I was like oh shit, this is what everyone was complaining about. When I mistreated someone I cared about and they actually followed through with cutting me out of their life. Father died and gave his inheritance to his 25 year GF. My mom got seriously ill in cancer and ended up in the ICU for five months. I had to get my shit together real quick now that she couldn't fix my messes anymore. When I discovered things like electricity and water come with monthly bills. My dad's diagnosed with debilitating disease and can no longer work. I have a now retired hard working dad, and had a lovely stay at home mom. She passed away from cancer when I was 14 that was 12 years ago. It was right when I was starting high school, put a lot of things in perspective. I don't know if spoiled is the right word, but I grew up in a wealthy, albeit very abusive family. Becoming a homeless teen included a bit of a culture shock. Anyone else realize as an adult that your parents weren't always right when they called you spoiled growing up? Although mine definitely treated me better than their parents treated them but their parents were horrible. I was spoiled in the sense that I was infantilized. I didn't move out until I was 23. Having to keep up with all my own stuff, including life skills I was never taught, was a smack in the face. Can we please get some context as to why everyone thinks they were spoiled? Some of these comments sound like they got an apartment and realized bills are a thing. That's normal coming of age stuff emo. Having an eating disorder earlier in life made me realize that no one but me would take me out of the black void. Additionally, depression kind of helped me to be aware of my feelings and others, after therapy. When my sister died. We were teenagers. We were the rich family in a small town. I went from being envied to pitied. Being kicked out at 18 for not living up to my father's expectations. Went from silver spoon to dirt floor real quick. I was called spoiled my whole life by friends and family. Meanwhile when I went home from school every night my mom would beat me on and off for hours and would starve me on purpose to keep me slim and trim I was in elementary school. That you had to pay your debts back and debt was a real, countable thing. I always chalked it up to this imaginary thing that wasn't a big deal. Oh boy. Becoming an adult and realizing I can't just drop 20k on shopping to make me feel better. I'm still spoiled we're just lower middle class. But working in a refugee center for four years really made me shut up about how hard my life is. Becoming a mom. It was hard but probably the best thing that ever happened to me. Both parents died and I had to look after my 13 year old sister. Got to college and I was genuinely pretty shocked that everyone else didn't have month long vacations in the south of France eating in Michelin star restaurants etc must have seemed like a real dick to quite a few people. Moved to a different country to study and started living outside of my bubble of privilege, honestly, best thing I could have ever done for myself. Moving from a private school to a public school, instant slap in the face from reality. Father passed away. He gave me everything I needed and wanted. Instead of an inheritance, I received all his lawsuits and debts. All of a sudden I had to grow up. It took me years. Moving out and having to pay rent. Rent they came and I'm like but that's all my money. Learned real quick how to be a little better with money. Moving out and being poor. Becoming a homeless heroin addict been clean for two years now but damn if that won't change your perspective. My stepdad came into the picture and started making me sit, facing a corner whenever I was a brat. It seemed to work. AIDS. I joined the Peace Corps and a few years later I was diagnosed with MS. Parents made me sign a contract to live with them after college, including a condition that they could call the cops on me if I used threatening language, which included curse words. I couch surfed for a few months after that. Racking up credit cards and looking for someone to pay them. 
The dishes and laundry don't just magically get done. Cliche but it was my first rent payment and realizing that I couldn't just use my whole paycheck for fucking off. The 2008 Recession 2008 When I had to wash a bathroom for the first time. My parents passed three months apart and I realized it was time to kill the child and let the adult be born. When I got to the age and wanted bigger toys lifestyle and realized I have to work for it. Best thing that ever happened to. Getting my first apartment and not having air conditioning during summer was a big slap in the face from reality and my privilege. At the age of 13 I went from living in a mansion to sleeping in a car because it turns out my dad had committed many white collar crimes and our bank accounts were frozen assets seized. The massive credit card debt I was in at the ripe age of 20. Still paying it off. I'm close, but it screwed with me for a while. Going from a great university and great family money at home to moving overseas, being treated like a dumb immigrant, and temporarily washing dishes. I regret nothing. Oh and the first paycheck, those taxes made me feel robbed.